Welcome back to the show. We're heading into the 814, taking you to the town of St. Mary's, Pennsylvania, where that's home to a very special artist, Pete Winkle Bauer, and also a very special art gallery. Thanks so much for uh, making the trip to come see us here in Altoona. Thank you, Morgan. You, you're a fan of the show, Pete, and yes. um, you're a longtime artist. Tell me about your evolution of how you uh, came to be. Well, I was born and raised in Altoona. Went to Bishop Guilfoyle High School, and I went to college, and after college, I landed in St. Mary's, and I taught art at Elk County Catholic High School for 48 years. Wow. I retired and honestly didn't like it. I still <laughs> had my painting, which I'd been painting for over 40 years. And a former student of mine asked me if we could work together and open a gallery. And I said, Jesse, that's a great idea. And so we did. And we didn't know what to name it. So we thought about it. And I had told Jesse one time, oh, years, a couple of years back, that he was my 29th high school student mm -hmm. that now teaches art. It's up to about 31 now. Okay in teaching art and it, to me that's that's the greatest thing going for me i i loved it i had a job that i loved and now i'm doing what i love i i paint i paint every day and uh i'm a watercolor artist yes and and you've inspired so many students and that's kind of the the importance of that number and i i love that you have this gallery and then you also do some uh, workshops we've got some pictures of you uh in your classes there so all of these are watercolor that All, you do? I teach watercolors okay. exclusively. Uh, Jesse teaches some drawing, and we have a couple of other artists too that work in the gallery. And so, Gallery 29 is going well, yeah. going real it's well. It's a great space. And you brought some of uh, your works of art here yeah, with just, you today. Can we show some of these off? Sure. Do you want to hold it up? Sure. And this is just magnificent just the colors all right i'm going to flip this around tell us about this piece uh this piece is owned by a lady in ridgeway um the retrospective show that i have coming up is going to be somewhere around a hundred pieces and this is one of them this is a landscape watercolor um i paint in all genre i i've done just about anything you can do in as far as the subject matter, I've done them in watercolor. And this is owned by Ann Prosky in Ridgeway. Yeah, it's beautiful. And you also do some commission work, too. A lot of commission work, yeah. yeah. This is um, one of a favorite piece of mine, a portrait. It's my, my very good friend's daughter. And Jessica graduated, a, oh, seven or eight years ago. And her mom commissioned me to do a portrait of Jessica. And that's how it turned out. Linda Franco owns that. It's and the last beautiful. piece I have to show today, I, I do a lot of very abstract pieces, too. Yes. And this is one of those abstract pieces. I love it. No subject matter, really. Just a lot of color and a lot of motion. And uh, just things that are fun for me to do. Now, Pete, working with watercolor is kind of tricky. Uh, some people seem to think <laughs> so. I've done it so long. I don't know how many paintings I've done, but uh, it can be a little tricky, but I, th I think it's easy. And, yeah, you know, at this point. I can, do a, I can do a painting like this landscape in probably three hours. Wow. So you've got it down to a science. Pretty, pretty close, I guess. Yeah. Now, are you looking at a picture, or are you just going? No, here? this is purely from imagination. Wow. Now, the portrait I I used a resource of Jesse, but I put it into my own subject area. That, uh, yeah, I really appreciate coming to my hometown and being on TV. This is and you interviewing me. Of course, we're happy I watch to have you, you, and so I. I know Morgan. Yeah. yeah, it is. It's like we're friends, and yeah. and we love supporting things like this. If people are interested in taking a workshop or coming to visit the gallery, how can they find you guys? We the retrospective show that I'm doing this starting this Friday, from five until nine. But if you want to learn anything about Gallery 29, go to Gallery 29 on the website. Mm -hmm. And Jesse, Jesse's a whiz at. Uh, 
handling the computer and all that thing, have all that kinds of stuff. So I'm just a painter. I know. I saw a lot of your um, your work on your Facebook, and it, it's just incredible what you do. And we appreciate you coming to share this with us. I thank you. Thank you for having me. I, I, it's so nice. Yeah, we're happy to have you. And if you missed any of those details on Gallery 29, or uh, some of the workshops and things like that, we're going to have all of that posted on our website, wtaj.com. Time to get a check of our weather forecast in just a bit. We're going to check in with Christy. Hey Morgan, we had rainfall earlier today, but it's going to dry out, but more rain is on the way by the middle half of the week. I'll have your 8-1 forecast coming up.